Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'm sharing all the Black Friday deals and sales for clothing. Um, now, if you're looking to like update your wardrobe, purchase some new clothing pieces, I'm gonna be sharing my all-time favorite pieces that I currently own. So I'm gonna do this video a little bit differently. Normally, I hold the clothing and I explain it to you and talk about it, um, but I really want the focus to be on the clothing and how you see it on me. So this entire video is gonna be me wearing the clothing and then I'm going to be doing a voiceover and just talking about it. I am filming this ahead of time, so I'll either write down on the screen what the sale is for each retailer or I'll write it in the description box because I'm filming this ahead of time but I'm gonna edit it later I'm not sure at this very moment what the discounts are for each item but again I will either write it on the screen as I'm showing the item and talking about it or I will write it in the description box for you guys so anyways I really hope you guys find this video helpful and find some pieces and clothing pieces that you really love and enjoy I will also write down my size measurements so you can use that for your reference in the description box everything is going to be linked down below and then I'll also number everything as well so that way you can look at the number on the screen and then reference it into the description box so it makes it a lot easier to find what you're looking for so anyways with that being said let's Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're starting off with Levi's. So they are doing their best sale they do out of the entire year, which is 40% off everything. And I believe they're also doing 50% off their clearance items last time I checked. Uh, but these are the Levi's 501 Skinnies. I am obsessed with these. This vintage light wash color is absolutely beautiful. It's so flattering. First, when you put it on, it comes in a little bit more snug than after you wear it for a little bit. It stretches out just a bit. And I think they overall end up looking even more flattering. So love the color love the fit it's honestly so stunning and then these are the levi's 501 medium wash so these are very similar to the light wash except these do not have as much stretch into them as the previous ones but they have the same fit to them so also a very beautiful medium wash color it's just uh, one color throughout there's no fading or whiskering um, the hemline i had to cut it uh, to fit my height personally a little bit better which i'm five foot zero but um, I love them. I think they look really, really beautiful. And then these are the Levi's Wedgie Icon jeans, which I haven't shared these in a while. I've had these for a long time. Uh, so their Wedgie jeans are honestly very flattering. Like their 501s and their Wedgie jeans are incredible. So this is the first style of the Wedgie jeans. These ones are more of like a skinny slash slim leg jean. Uh, the next ones I'm gonna share uh, with you guys are more of a straight leg jean, but these are a medium wash, uh, more of a skinny jean for the Wedgie style. And then here are the Levi's Wedgie straight jeans. So so these are a bit more tapered out past the knee, I believe 14 or 15 inches. And I really like the wedgie style. I think they make the behind look so flattering. And also the wedgie style are more petite friendly. Like these jeans, they come in a 26 inch inseam, which is fabulous for petites. I'm also wearing these in a size 23. I could have easily done a 24. I'm usually between 23 and 24, but I wanted these to be a little bit more snug. So I went with that. And then now we're gonna move on to Abercrombie. So they're doing 30% off site wide. And these are the high rise skinny jeans. So these have a little bit of stretch into them. The back pockets, if you see, they have no stitching or anything. So they're very clean, very simple. There's a tiny bit of distressing in the front um, where the pockets are. And then the hemline of it, the back of it is a little bit distressed but they're so flattering, uh, very petite friendly. Obviously I did not have to do any adjusting with these. I went with a size 24 short. I would say they're true to size. If you're in between sizes, it's always a good idea to go up a size in Abercrombie because I feel like they run a little bit small in their denim jeans, but the 24 fit me great. And then these are their black button fly skinny jeans. So these have a lot of stretch into them, super comfy, but still like suck you in um, and just really overall flattering. So it has the button fly. If if you're not into the button fly, they have an option where it's just a zipper um, if you're not into that. But very petite friendly and I believe these also come in extra short. So if you're even shorter than me, below five foot zero, they have extra short options. All right, so these are their faux leather pants. I love these so much. So they're not like a faux leather pant, they're more just like a coated jean. And I think they are so fun to style for the fall and winter, kind of make outfits a little bit more edgy. So these I got in a short uh, 24. So I would say if you're in between sizes, definitely go up a size because these do run pretty small and pretty snug. So uh, if you want it to be more comfortable, I definitely recommend going up a size, but I love how these just make outfits a little bit more edgy. 
stretchy and then these are their mom jeans so i love these for a straight leg jean they kind of look more like a straight leg jean on my body type not so much of that mom style but they're so simple and they taper out past the knee i believe like 13 or 14 inches they have a button fly which i really like the length is also perfect i'm wearing them in a short very petite friendly so i definitely recommend these for like a more inexpensive option for a beautiful medium wash straight leg jean and then this is their puffer jacket. So I tested out and tried on so many of their different puffer jackets. Personally, I really like this one because it's petite friendly and it has that hood, hello. Um, and, and it's puffy, but not too puffy. Some of their puffer jackets or a lot of them are ultra puffy and I'm not into that, but this one still has some puff without being extremely puffy. And then this is their wool blazer coat. I love this one. I've already been getting so much use out of this one. It's very warm. It comes a little bit oversized. So I would recommend if you want a little bit of a tighter fit than what I'm showing here, uh, go down a size. But if you want to layer uh, sweaters underneath it, stick with your regular size. I went with an extra small petite and I can layer lots of like thick and chunky knits under it which will keep me warm for the winter time and then this is their drapey trench coat so last last I looked uh, they're very low in stock in these but they might restock it during you know all the sales so um, if you're interested in it check it out and see if your size is available it comes in so many colors it's very flattering petite friendly um, has more of a drapey look to it and then this is their dad coat so this one is honestly such a staple in your closet you guys you will get so much use out of this camel coat i'm wearing this in an extra extra small petite i went down a size i probably could have even just done an extra small and it would have left some room for me to layer thicker knits so i would definitely recommend if you're interested in it go with your regular size but it comes in petite it's so flattering fits really well in the sleeves and the shoulders i've recommended this so many times and honestly i really love this jacket and then this is their midi skirt i love this one so much it's drapey really pretty it has a side slit very flattering for petites it also comes in a couple other colors and last I checked with the sale they have going on it is just under $50 and you can style it in so many different ways I love layering different sweaters over it and wearing sock booties I think uh, that looks fabulous together and the next thing I want to share are their body suits so these are their square neck body suits these ones particularly go in and out of stock constantly so I will link these exact ones and then they have one that's a little bit different that's like double lined it has like two layers of fabric it's also a square neck which is really beautiful it's in their like luxe fabric material so i have this one in three colors love it very flattering their bodysuits are honestly just in general amazing and i will link several different kinds i have from them but these are my current favorites right now and then this turtleneck sweater you guys this is like one of my favorite basic sweaters for the fall and winter i've probably worn this 10 times now i've already had it for like a month and i'm just constantly pulling for it i love the length of it not too long has side slits really comfortable and very high quality and then now moving on to Madewell. So they are running 30% off their entire site. I love their denim jeans. So if you're looking for a really good high quality pair of denim jeans, they have it. So them and Levi's, uh, Abercrombie, they make my favorite jeans. Um, these ones are their vintage high rise jeans. So these are more of like a slim leg slash straight leg type of jeans. So in between, very flattering, very clean, very simple. No stitching in the back or anything. The hemline of it is finished. I got these in a 24 petite and I would say they are true to size uh, I just love the back pocket placement they're like nice and large and uh, wearing these with sneakers like I am here I think they look really cool wearing it with the white bodysuit from Abercrombie and you know I love styling this in so many different ways and then the next thing I'm gonna share is this uh, petite city coat so i'm actually wearing the madewell jeans with this coat so i think it looks really cute together and uh with the white bodysuit but this jacket is very petite friendly and i'm wearing this in a double zero petite i would say just go with your regular size and i think that will fit great the sleeve length fits really well i love the length of it and overall it's a really really good jacket it comes in several different colors and i'm constantly pulling for this and wearing it on repeat so love this one definitely recommend it really great for petites and then for the shoes so 
Looking at DSW's site, it didn't show any sales. I think they're just doing sales for Nike, like 25% off for the weekend. Um, but uh, I'm just gonna link my favorite shoes I got from them in case you wanted to check them out. These sneakers have been a top seller here and I've gotten so much good feedback from you guys that you love them. I definitely recommend these for a really nice white sneaker. And then these black combat boots I've shared so many times. These are by Mark Fisher. If you're looking for a really good, high quality, sturdy pair of combat boots for the winter time that are also cute, I definitely definitely recommend these. These are priced at like right, right at $99. Uh, for the quality, I think that's a really reasonable price point. I love these. And then these sock booties, you guys know I'm obsessed with wearing sock booties. These are from Mark Fisher. I paid about, I believe, $80 for them. And I love styling them. Here's, here I am wearing it with a dad coat bodysuit and then the Madewell jeans. I think they look great together. And overall, uh, they're a little bit more pricey, but they're so worth it if you wear them often, which personally I wear them constantly. So I love these. All right, so that is it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the pieces that I love. Hopefully you guys can save some money, get some good deals. So again, everything is linked in the description box down below. If you are interested in anything, my size is written in the description box down below. And happy shopping. Hopefully you guys get some good deals, find something you love. Uh, remember, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.